Hi guys, my name is Bart and I'm going to present my application Wi-Fi Survey. Just quick overview, this application was made to provide actually graphical view of the Wi-Fi signal in scanned area. Basically what it does, it's creating a heat signature of the Wi-Fi waves which allow us to see where is the best reception and where we have black spots. It's really hard to find out where actual Wi-Fi works in the room, building or any area. Uh, I'm sure that many people have this problem that in some spots Wi-Fi is not working at there and uh, sorry and there is no way to provide any information. This program allows to provide this information creating a visualization of the Wi-Fi waves. Let me show you some examples of the scans I made a few days ago. Right, this is a uh, uh, basically a uh, floor of the building uh, size well let's say 50 meters long I would say uh, there's a big space in the building and on the right hand side we can see there's a cash desk and on the top corner top right corner there's uh, another room uh, which is uh, 18 section uh, on this uh, map we can see where access point actually exists. The access point is in the cash desk room and we can see on the map, we can see the heat map, the red area is growing around the cash desk. Um, this application provides uh, results of the scanned area according to the points we measure so uh, basically I measured the point in a uh, cash desk which shows 56 uh, the numbers are the it's, it's, it's basically calculated in DBM so the lowest number is the best quality of the wireless signal uh, then I was going around the uh, building on the f uh, around the floor and I was taking another measurements so according to those uh, one two three four five six seven points the heat map was generated with this result also in the building there is more than one access point and uh, basically application takes uh, scans of all wireless networks in the area so for each point we can actually generate uh, different Wi-Fi networks so let me show you the second uh, scan this is the first scan with uh, access point in the cash desk and let me show you the second scan now there you go well obviously the wireless is not too strong on this uh, schematic but it shows you more or less where the waves uh, going where is the strongest wireless signal in which area right let's let's go to the application okay so next option is new survey okay let's click new survey Right, then we can put some name, let's say, well, test, okay, server name, let's say test123, okay, right, now, with base image, <coughs> we can get the image out of the folder, which is uh, Wi-Fi images, we put, the f we put the picture in, so if I click that, we got option to get arcade.jpg which is in the folder Wi-Fi survey, okay? It's which is schematic of the place uh, of my uh, scan. Okay, start capture. Right, now we have the uh, well picture of the of the area we want to scan, okay? Right, most important thing, we need to have four points at least to make a scan, right? So let's let's start let's go to cash desk okay so basically we walk to the cash desk we are in the cash desk then we click scan for signals okay and it's scanning what's going on in that location 
basically we need to walk from one place to the other according to the points on the map just to make the proper measurement I did compare those measurements to other software uh, you can use with a laptop and do it, do it exactly the same just walking around and the scan and generate heat map but it's really com it's, it's, it's more complicated and you know this is this is the simplest way and actually the reason why I made this application okay we have a point okay so we save this point okay now when we save it jumps to the point two so we have to put on the map where exactly uh, we going now let's say 18 section 18 okay point number two is on 18 section then click on the scan again and it scans the application uh, sorry it scans the area uh, in this room so we have to wait again and uh, we will get some results for this point and after that we do point by point by point by point as many points we can get the measurement will be uh, more precise so I will pause the uh, movie at the moment and I will do some more scans and I will get back to you when I will get some more results right I'm back um, right when we finish our uh, all points um, on the map to scan uh, basically you click done when we do that we can go to the list of the surveys and we should we should have our survey in here I will use one of my scans before just to show you how it works okay so we've got some uh, survey actions which is view view map compare map edit delete or cancel well obviously cancel <laughs> I don't need to explain uh, view okay let's go to view view is really simple it shows you a list of the points and, and basically some simple data like the name of the site survey name uh, what, what the date of the creation uh, when it was modified and you know some simple simple positions okay when we go back we can click that again and then we got view map uh, where we have actually more options right now we can generate a heat map of the scanned area according to access points we have uh, in the database scan it according to the points so if I click the drop down menu we have the Royal Pier Co UK but we also have boom BT fusion live box BT business hub so this is all networks which was detected during the scan okay so let's say you want to do a scan for a boom okay let's do generate now we have generated a heat map of the wireless point uh, of the wireless access point boom and just to see more or less where is it we can also add the base picture which basically allows us to uh, show where is the best signal of this access point in this area okay so we've got in cages with 56 it's showing in um, dbm so the lowest number uh, the best signal is and we can see in the whole uh, floor the best signal is around the cache desk and half 18 section and the other side of the room okay so we can save that and it will save into the folder out in the Wi-Fi images and then we can use it uh, as, a, as a picture it saves as a JPEG file so uh, you can use that uh, later in the presentation or you can print it out and you can show let's say to a customer that you know the access point the best area of the of this access point is, is in this area and let's say if you have to design the network if you have to put more access points in this floor you know more or less where to put the access points just to cover the whole area okay right so 
we can also you know choose uh, different uh, wireless networks and click generate again and it will generate a uh, heat map according to the levels uh, and uh, well you can save that again and use that again okay we can also compare which is compare map and when we do that we can choose two access point let's say the boom and ray up here let's do generate map so now it will generate two heat maps okay two signatures we can do base map and we can add the pictures underneath and now we can see the red one is the boom and the green one is the royal pier and we can see how they cover uh, the whole space of the of the floor okay we can also save that to a uh, file and uh, and use it use use after okay right um, all right let's go back okay next option is uh, edit where we can add more points to the presentation uh, to the sorry to the survey and then we can you know save and generate ma maps again according you know according to points and the last option is delete which we which, which I don't want to do it now uh, but I'll press cancel but when you press delete it will remove the whole survey from the database right uh, okay let's go back okay I think this is uh, this this is covering whole um, uh, <laughs> I would say manual for a uh, Wi-Fi survey uh, I want you to uh, see basically how it works and you know before you bu before you pay for this application uh, I want you to see what's going on and how it works also I would like to add this uh, this project will be uh, carry on I will uh, add few things uh, in some time to this application like uh, I will work on the better graphic user interface at the moment it's really 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 simple it's supposed to work and it's made just to just just to work for for basic uh, basic stuff so at the moment it is uh, how it is if you like it I, I, i'll be i'm happy if you will uh, if you will buy it uh, and if, if if you're not happy you can always come back in some time and and see what changes uh, are made in in, in in the whole application i have few really good uh, ideas uh, for example, you'll be able to access uh, files from the web uh, server, so you can run the web server on the phone, and you can log in wirelessly to the phone uh, over the web interface, and you can add the files or remove the files uh, with the maps. Um, obviously, the gra uh, graphic user interface will be much better, and uh, I'm working on a better scan function function for uh, wireless so uh, well just stay tuned